Welcome back inside the film room. Dustin Fox here alongside Bernie Kosar. And Bernie, the Browns are back in action this week against the Cincinnati Bengals, a divisional matchup. Important to get a win. 0-3 start, not the way you, you want to get the season going. This being a Battle of Ohio interstate game, uh, Cincinnati needs this win just as bad. No team wants to go 0-4 to start the first month of the season. They had a, a good matchup uh, this past week against Green Bay, and we're going to take a look at some of these offensive plays this first one's going to be a third and three situation. Joe Mixon, the rookie out of Oklahoma, is uh, offset here in the backfield. And it's going to be a, an interesting way to set up a, a, a tailback screen. Cincinnati has a couple of strong tendencies. You can see A.J. Green, number 18, to the bottom left of your screen here, come in motion. When he comes in motion to a two-receiver two set like this, a lot of times Cincinnati's using this to get him in a kind of a bunch position to get a free release down the field. The corner does a nice job here for Green Bay, seeing that it is a quick screen to the left here. He comes off A.J. Green here. And they sort of trick the defense because if you look at it, you know, Mixon's offset here to the right, and they're going to bring the motion down inside. So everything's going to the right, and the last second, Mixon will cut behind Andy Dalton, and then you get the, the guard and tackle out in space, and look at that. Look at this hit on this corner. I mean, that is, I've been there. You just want to get the heck out of the way. <laughs> It's actually a good job, all things considered, by, by both sides of the ball here. Well, he forces it back inside, at least is all you can ask for at that point. And then, you know, ha-ha, Clinton Dix probably needs to make that tackle. A lot of discussion about Joe Mixon and him dropping in the draft this year with some off-the-field things. But at the end of the day, in between the white lines, Cincinnati is loaded at running back and offensive weapons. Uh, Mixon's just one of three guys for Cincinnati that could run the ball with great efficiency. All right, this is something you, you talked to us about as we prepared for this segment. You want to see a lot, you, you expect the, the Bengals to do a lot of this three by one stuff where they'll isolate A.J. Green on the backside. A lot of their core offenses come by this three by one set. A.J. Green to the bottom of your screen, the lone receiver, X receiver, three receivers to the top of the field. You get, you get a clear distinction of, of who the coverage guys are. You have A.J. Green one on one here. Safety stays to the weak side. Now Green Bay's actually in a good defense, double covering A.J. Green. Andy Dalton still stays with him, which is a big key, a big indicator. Then even in a not the best of coverage, Andy Dalton's going to stay with A.J. Green. And the thing is, you know, Green Bay, I think they have the right idea because they've got it, it bracketed. You, you see the outside corner there, number 20, and the, in the safety here, they're, they're double covering him, but the safety's so deep. So he doesn't even give himself a chance the window's wide open and Dalton puts it in there. You know, you can't allow A.J. Green to get comfortably down the field about 17, 18 yards and get into that, that hole right there, fill that void. Yep. That's, that's an easy pitch and catch. Bernie, we, we obviously know A.J. Green's a tremendous talent. What sort of challenges does he present for the Browns this week? Well, he's a sleeping nightmare for the D coordinator and for the defensive backs. He's one of the premier fantastic players in the league. He's done it consistently over multiple years. So that'll be one of the keys in stopping the passing game is shutting down and at least slowing down A.J. Green. A lot of double coverage? You, do, you know what you see though, even in double coverage, he's getting open. So yeah. it depends on how that running game's going. You know, they, they're really loaded at running back and we need well, sometimes need that safety in there uh, for the support of the running game. But typically it's safer to get some double coverage on A.J. Green, absolutely. I'm Dustin, he's Bernie. Thanks for joining us inside the film room as we look at the Cincinnati Bengals offense.